Hey guys, this is IFB Pro Luke Sando. This is my road to the Arnold Series 2019 for Redcon 1, exclusively at Nick's Strength and Power. Hey guys, so welcome to, I think this is episode three of my Road to the Arnold Classic Series on Nick's Strength and Power. So we're gonna do a little bit of food prep. Um, I sent my pictures to Chris and Cito this morning, give me a high carb day. So we've got to go to the supermarket to get some uh, cookies, which is good. So you can, just, you can see exactly what cookies I have, because that is the secret. Uh, we're going to be doing some, we got back this afternoon, so we've got a heavy back session. I've got to take the dog for a walk, just all the classic stuff. Um, and also after my training this evening, I have a massage booked, um, which is something I've been doing this whole prep and it's been a huge help. Um, there's no gun, car chases or guns or anything cool like that. It's just all eating, resting, working, sleeping, dog walking, massage, training sleeping, eating, massage, training, eating, sleeping, dog walking. That's my life. Um, I'm not complaining. I just, you guys are watching it and it's boring. Sorry. So I've got two bagels here and five, a half a litre of really, really poorly cooked burned egg whites. Uh, I did burn them out a little bit. Um, but as you can see, presentation is key. Um, I'm a bit of a master chef, as you can see by the quality of this meal. I take my cooking very seriously. Um, in fact, the way I like to do it is I like to make it look nice and then make it look like somebody's punched it really hard. And I think that makes it look good. It makes it more powerful and rustic. And it looking like three and a half weeks out from the Iron Classic yesterday. So, getting close now. <laughs> Just like I watch Jay Cut, but they watch mine. <laughs> Got my shopping list. Cookies, chicken, steak, high carbs. Get some more rice and stuff. Uh, potato as well, I mean, got a whole shopping list on my phone. So yeah, let's go. Cookies! Get the squeeze. Car parks and roads and car park spaces are smaller in England. I don't know if you knew that. Chivalry isn't dead. Gave me his trolley. Chicken. It's all like the mini fillets or tenderloins. Yeah, so I normally have steak because I get rice today. I'm having, I usually use the ground beef. This ground beef and rice is the best. It's so busy in there, what's going on? I can see them, they have the ones we want. They're still warm. White chocolate and honeycomb. The secret is the honeycomb. Because the bees have... <laughs> I was going to try and say something science then, but they're just cookies. These are just the best ones. Seven up free. It's not free, you still have to pay for it. There's just no sugar or calories in it. So per bottle, five calories. Not bad, is it? High day, little treat to have my pre-workout meal. Oh, fuck off, come on. There we go. Why are you taking so long? Nailed it.
No. Look at Why are you like this? Is it because you... Wait, wait, I know, I know. Do you want to go for a walk? Do you want to go for a walk? Do you go for a walk? You don't know what to do, do you? Where's your lead? Where's your lead? Let's go for a walk. Yeah? Where's your lead? Where's your lead? Go on then, let's go for a walk. Right, I've had some mail. Yes, we are going to go for a walk. Just relax. I'm trying to film, yeah? Just just wait your turn. Right, sorry about that. Right. Oh, here we go. These are my trunks for the Arnold. They've just turned up. So you got, you got a bit of exclusive here. These are from Iron Monkey. These are the best trunks. These are the only trunks I've ever used. Um, and she hand makes everything from scratch. So if you ever put an order in, she just hand makes it for you. Oh, look at these. Look at these. These are black something. Yeah, I know, I know. Let's see what we got here. These are like a slightly red color. These look pretty cool. Nice. Nice. And what are these? What are these ones? These ones look silver. Space pants, these ones. <laughs> are they a bit much, do you think? Are these a bit much? I don't, I don't think I can pull these ones off. What do you think, Kayleigh? Yeah. Really? Well, I got some, I got these ones, these are cool. Mm -hmm. These are black with like crimson glitter. Oh. So these are really, these are the red con colors, so they're black with a bit of red mixed in. I think these are the winners. I think we found the winner, boys mm -hmm. and girls, or whatever gender specific you are, non-binary. Here we go. Stronger than he looks. This is my cardio for today. Because he said, do, do no cardio tomorrow, but make sure your no cardio is really hard. It's funny, isn't it? It's good. Good joke. But yeah, yeah, so I mean, I still try and keep active. Um, I think one of the worst things you can do is when you're really tired, um, is just kind of laze about doing nothing. Because... I don't, I'm all for conserving energy, but if you're just literally just lying on your ass doing nothing and you're trying to get in shape, it can't help. Surely moving around more is going to help you. So that's what kind of helps is when you're very tired, keep moving. Keep Just get up on your feet, do some housework, wash your car, I don't know, take the dog for a walk, go for a little wander around the, around the block, anything to keep you active, you know. So the little shit's been walked. We... Uh, I'm going to be training, uh, leaving here in about an hour, so I'm going to get my, some, my pre workout meal prepped and cooked. And it's just uh, 50 grams of carbs from rice, 4 cookies, and 10 ounces of cooked chicken. So I will prepare that now. Look at this little rice cooker, it's pretty good, isn't it? Little rice cooker. The one I had before was about this big. <laughs> and to do 50 grams of carbs from rice in it was a nightmare, and it would always burn, so I bought this little small one. Um, if you don't have a rice cooker, what are you doing with your life? Sushi rice is the best. Um, a lot of people say, oh, but it's higher, it's got a higher glycemic index, blah, 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 spikes of blood glucose too much. It's the same, it's just rice. I used to be a big sauce guy, uh, now I just use a little bit of soy sauce on the rice. Uh, and then I use just, this is smoked salt and a barbecue something grinder. And I just have those two on the chicken, that's it. Four cookies today. Look at this. Oh, so what I'm gonna do now, is I'm gonna pop them in the microwave for a minute so they're all like gooey and 
soft and just you can eat it with a spoon. And then, uh, oh, this is the best. Time to eat. Cookies, rice and chicken, four tabs of RPG. Can't bloody wait. Let's get, let's get tucked in. This is what a cookie should be like. Look at, look at, look at that. Just floppy. It's almost, look at that. Wait, wait. Oh. That's how you cookie. If you think I'm wrong, I don't want to hear it. You're wrong. So I've got 30 grams of grunt and 40 grams of cluster bomb. So that's about 20, 25 grams of essential aminos and 30 grams of carbs have while I train. That's not because it's a high carb day. That's just what I have every session. Every session, intra carbs, intra aminos. I've done that for years. It's just, it's just become part of my re uh, regimen now. So I just, it's one of those things that a lot of people think the intra workout carbs don't work, but they aren't needed. Are they needed? No. Do they help? Yes. That's why I'm doing it because every little helps. So we're at 75 grams of carbs from rice cereal. And I will have 70 grams of whey isolate from the isotopes. Oh, I've just eaten all those cookies. I feel good. Um, we're going to go head to the gym now because I'm back today. Um, so we get, go get changed. Go to the gym. I normally do my pre-workout there. So when we get to the gym, I'll do my big noise. Uh, my mental trigger, my tango, and then we'll get cracking. Here we are, Muscle Works Orbington. Just got here, it's time to hit some back. So we just wrapped up back. Uh, pretty pr quick pace, pretty re relatively low volume, a lot of heavy loading. Every ounce of muscle that I built, I want to keep it. So I'm doing everything I can, try and maintain my strength. I mean, as you'll be able to tell, every single weight I used today was fake. All fake plates, all fake dumbbells, fake machines, all fake. So, um, so yeah, just having my. Uh, my way of rice cereal. Um, a lot of you are probably thinking, cereal in prep? Why is having way so close to the show? Ask Chris Aceto. Arguably the best coach probably ever. Two Mr. Olympias. Track record speak for yourself. If he told me to eat donuts and baby poo, I'd eat it because that's all it takes. So I'm not eating all this delicious food I'm eating because I'm being told to eat it not because I'm choosing to eat it so uh, it is good right so we just wrapped training up probably over an hour ago um, and now I'm upstairs in the gym 
And I've come to see Daz, the absolute wizard, who's kept me in one piece this whole prep. So um, I've had some issues with my lats. I probably shouldn't see him on back day, but it's the way our, our schedules line up, sorry. So we're gonna uh, have some soft tissue work. Um, I've had some issues with my right lat for about three years, and it hasn't actually been helped by anyone. Um, I've seen chiropractors, I've seen God knows how many people. Um, and Dad's actually managed to fix it in two sessions, so he's definitely a keeper. Okay, so that's the end of episode three on uh, my road to the Arnold Classic Series 2019 for Nick's Strength and Power. So we've had a day at home, we've done some training, I've had some soft tissue, I'm a bit sore, but I feel pretty good. So we're three and a half weeks out, a couple more episodes, so stay tuned for the next one.